Hi guys and welcome to a video sponsored by EA Game Changers. The EA Studios in Orlando invited me over kindly to play Madden 17. They paid for my travel and they paid for uh, my hotel and stuff like that to go and fly over. So we have a few videos coming out on Madden 17. The video you're about to see guys is a MUT video which is Madden Ultimate Team. It is a work in progress, it is not the final game guys so please bear that in mind while watching the video. So in front of you guys is a Madden Ultimate Ultimate team. This is where you collect your favourite cards and add them into your ultimate team. It does have a new chemistry system this year, which I am going to be talking about briefly. Basically, giving you a 101 of what to do when picking your team and uh, going for them bigger and better players. Now, in previous Madden's guys, the chemistry system was very, very different um, that I remember when playing it. And one thing you do need to remember, guys, with these videos, I am rock bottom, as in rock bottom, um, with my knowledge of both NFL and Madden. But I'm going to get used to the game as soon as it comes out. Now, thankfully, um, the EA guys were very, very helpful at the studios and did give me a lot of ideas of how to bring videos to you guys to explain it and how it does work. So with the chemistry system, the way it's done now, totally different to FIFA. It does have a pie chart system on the right-hand side, as you guys can see, uh, with the lit-up blue um, segments in the pie chart. If you get two players from um, one certain chemistry style, and you guys can see all of them um, in the game, itself, I think it was in the binder where you go and find it, you can add two players into the team which will give a boosted rating on some of the players into the team. So on the screen you are seeing a few players boosted in our offence which have got the chemistry styles activated. It's not just one chemistry style, it's a few of them. So with the offence and defence as well, I don't think there was any activated in the defence as we're looking at this, but if you guys can fill the pie charts up, you can have numerous amounts of them activated at the same time to give the blue boosts um, and obviously style upgrades to the players uh, but you can also have numerous amounts running at the same time on both offense and defense as soon as you take the players out of the team that um, chemistry style is not activated anymore and then you can start putting in some more others so it's a very very interesting uh, concept and the way they've done it I was very very excited to see it along with all the other guys who were at the capture event as well um, a lot of people trying out and thankfully the uh, studio did give us a a lot of players to show you guys not only with the different card styles like the legend which you see highlighted there but also the flashbacks and I think there may be a signature card as well uh, which is in the LE1 position there um, so it's it's a good way of doing it it all obviously does make you alter the way you do build teams a lot of people in previous Maddens including myself actually last uh, Madden I did build my team to uh, uh, overall so get the highest overall um, but obviously that isn't the way you can do well you can do it that way if you wanted to but this way I think it's going to be a lot better as you can get boosted player um, stats on the cards and obviously make you guys play a lot better. So there's going to be new ones added in throughout the year as well guys uh, something very very exciting to look forward to. Um, at the start of the Madden game there's going to be a lot activated but then you're going to add more in throughout the uh, throughout the year. So you guys are seeing now we have got Frederick uh, apologies if I do butcher names, I do it on my channel all the time. Anyway um, he has an 88 rated boosted card just because of the chem style in the game. If you look at the substitute players and we're doing the compare now guys you can see what difference was made to this card just by having that chemistry activated and uh, it boosts him from an 87 to an 88 and it also boosts some of his uh, individual stats as you can see with the blue um, blue text and blue numbers as well. Very very interesting. A lot of people will know more about it than I will but I'm going to try and keep it basic guys so you guys do con uh, grasp the concept of what's going on in the game. How you guys can go about building teams and obviously any Anyone who's got this team at the start of the game is going to be insane. But we were at a capture event, so we were given the players, and uh, thankfully we could have a play around with them. So what the blue text and the blue writing does, uh, blue text and the blue numbers do mean, guys, is it gives a boost to the stats. These are the players which are boosted by the uh, making the segments full on the chemistry. The more players you add into the team, um, the obviously the better stats you can get on some of the players. Now there is more than one tier to some of these chem styles as well. I think it goes all the way up to three. As uh, I don't think. I can show you in this video um, what I was having a look around at, but there is some which move on up. In this team alone, guys, we had two chemistry styles activated, uh, which were the top two. The white ones are the ones you are working towards, which are on the right-hand side. 
and uh, that's basically the chem styles moving around. So I am going to be doing these videos, guys, like you don't understand um, what Madden is. A lot of you guys will play the game, um, and I want to obviously bring it up. I want to bring people up with me to play the game, get good at the game, uh, as obviously I'm way down at the bottom now, but also give you an insight into what happens in the game. So you are seeing on the screen now, guys, a flashback card. This is Alan. Alan is a wide receiver. He has a special card due to uh, a, an event in NFL, which he did back in the day. You can see on the card. He's an 88 rated, and there is loads of special cards like this coming to the game and are going to be in the game. So different card styles you've got, guys. You've got the bronze, you've got the silver, you've got the gold. You have the red cards as well, which are the elite cards, which are nothing um, like in forms, but these are like your top grade players, uh, which are some of the ones which a lot of people were excited for when opening packs at the event as well, including myself. Um, but it's mainly some nice looking cards, very, very decent graphics as well. And uh, some of them, even though they may not be elites, could still be very, very good players in the game of Madden itself. So you are seeing there in my item binder, there was some blue stats as well, going back to the chemistry. And it's honestly going to be an amazing year of Madden. I cannot wait to play it. The game's not far out till it's released as well. And uh, not only uh, a pack opening is going to be a thing as well, because you guys know I have a pack addiction, not just on any other game, but any game which has a pack option, I am going to go absolutely hammer. So only uh, so with packs as well, guys, you can get the uh, unlockables, uh, which are like, uh, I'm going to say like a token, which you guys can add into a set, which we'll be talking about in another video to get you guys the bigger and better players that way as well. I remember in Madden uh, 16, I did was able to complete a set somehow uh, by playing the game. You are seeing Gronkow um, Gronkowski as well, who is the first of Madden uh, this year as well. Uh, very, very solid card, 91 rated, but as I said, guys, the uh, items are not graded correctly yet so the uh, stats of the players could change come the release so guys i really hope this video has been interesting to you i really hope it's helped you guys if you've not touched the game of madden and are going to be taking advantage of it on ea access when it's released uh, it's free to try on there and obviously i'm going to be doing a lot of videos throughout the year on madden ultimate team and uh, madden game itself so the flashbacks cards look absolutely sick the signature cards look absolutely awesome as well and uh, the same with some of the elite some of the pictures look absolutely sick so i I've really enjoyed my time out at EO Orlando, um, obviously having a play around in the game. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I hope you understand the chemistry style and how it works. And uh, obviously, thanks again, guys, for EA Sports for taking me out to Orlando to play the game early and uh, paying for my travel and hotel, etc. So you guys, if you want to know more about chemistry, there is a link down below. Go and check that, that video and the webpage out, guys. And hopefully you learn a little bit more on there and a little bit more in detail.